Oof. How long was I out? Welcome back, Hot Calc. You left me unplugged for like 20 years, what is wrong with you? You've got hypnomail. If it's any consolation, Hippie, I know the feeling of being unplugged for over 20 years. Ooh. The Hypnospace Archival Project. Oh. I was out for a while, huh? 2021. Whew. Hot Calc, I can't tell you how amazing it was to hear from you. It has been decades, but I knew there had to be someone out there with a working enforcer headband. Me and a few former Hypnospace citizens formed a ragtag group to preserve content from the service's late 1999 period, just before the crash. We've been unable to find anyone involved with Merchantsoft, outside of Artie, which is a story in and of itself. Oh, tell me about it. How's Artie doing, by the way? And we're pretty certain that the backup servers are long gone after Merchantsoft got raided. You represent the first major breakthrough we've had towards preserving a piece of history that would otherwise be lost. Please check out the Lost and Found page on our intranet and help us track down a few of those things there. I may have an additional task for you. You can help us locate a couple of those things. Enforcer headband units had an entire gigabyte of internal disk space. Our best guess is that Enforcer units doubled as a mini backup server, which conveniently wasn't told about to the unpaid moderators who might have scrapped them for parts. We coded a little program to help you help us extract the data accessible in your headband and op upload it to us. Download and install the attached program to get started. We are already excited to see what you dig back up. Okay, so they want us to check out Downloading the zone. Installed. But first we'll install hap. Mushi. Still a poop machine, I see. Let this install. Yeah. Okay, so it's like an archive of each date. Important message received from Hap underscore Tamara. Team strategy email. Oh, it's Tamara! Hello, everyone. First of all, I want to wish you a warm welcome to our newest member, Hot Calc. We couldn't be happier to have you. Happy face. The Hypnospace Archival Project needs more outside attention if it's going to survive. But it plainly, we need to attract donors. My own social reach can only go so far. The kids who read books don't remember forums, let alone Hypnospace. Oh, so she's an author now. That's nice. I've been reading about how to reach people on a personal level, and found that music is actually one of the strongest stimulators of both memory and emotion. To that end, our goal for the time being is to track down a few of the music-related things on our Lost and Found page. Remember that you can switch between multiple dates using the HAP tool. Let's harness that nostalgia. Date here. Lost and Found.
Actually, before we do this, let's... Let's read up on... The users here. Time. Flow. 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 Time. Steaming. Gone. 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 Yeah, that's... that's already. Did you use Hypnospace in 98 to 99? Hypnospace. Did we really use it, or did it use us? If so, did you do anything embarrassing? Embarrassment is shame. Humiliation is hurt. Embarrassment is not me, not us. <laughs> Artie, you're the best. What are you up to now? Lover, designer, giver, breeder of hope, agent of peace. Wonder-filled spirit is me. Yep, that's already. See, I don't remember Chelsea, though. Sorry about the lack of a picture. I'll have to get a suitable one uploaded soon. I'm Chelsea. It is unlikely anyone remembers me since I never made my own Hypnospace page or used Chit Chat. But Hypnospace was a very important part of my life. This whole archival project was my idea, and thankfully Tamara was interested, enough to help me foot the bill. Did you use Hypnospace in 98 to 99? Yes. If so, did you do anything embarrassing? Nope. If I ever got around to making a page, I would have had plenty to share. What are you up to now? A whole lot, really. Just worrying, working a boring office job and reminiscing about Hypnospace in my off time. Can't wait to see what we're able to dig up. There's that rating shell that that one guy used for his rating system. Hello everyone, I'm Tamara, perhaps better known nowadays as T. Frost. When Chelsea reached out to me about supporting the HAP, I literally jumped for joy. There was something special about Hypnospace. It felt like the lived-in place that folks out there are trying to preserve. Its history inspires me greatly. Sorry about the old picture. Tim, I wonder if... Hmm. It was a little strange using this page builder so many years later, but yes, hi, I'm Tim. Yep, the same Tim you probably heard about back in early 2000. Yes, I went to prison. Yes, I spent a whole six years there. I'm a much different person now as anyone after adolescence. Did you use Hypnospace in 98 to 99? Yes. If so, did you do anything embarrassing? I'm not really sure how to answer this one. Embarrassing is not the right word for what I cost. I still think about it every day, and I'm deeply, deeply sorry for it. I was a kid messing around with tech. I was a kid messing around with tech that I knew almost nothing about. My entire world revolved around wooing a girl I was infatuated with, and getting into hacker, getting into a hacker group, and I would have done anything to impress either one of them. I had no idea that, that I'd even be capable of harming people with the software I had made. It was all so, so stupid. What are you up to now? I work in computer security and live a contented life with my wife and daughter. Alright, calm down, Mushi. Give Mushi all this attention. It's been like 20 years, I'm sorry. Didn't mean to forget about you. It's just that you're hosted on a headband that can kill people. Yeah. It's not your fault. Let's read about this mind crash. 
The Y2000 mine crash was the year 2000 event. Without it, our biggest Y2K problem would have been two malfunctioning bus ticket validation machines in Aust Australia and a couple dozen disappointed end time preachers. Mine crash wasn't the fault of computer programming oversight or a date related bug. Its cause was an out of control joke virus created by a teenager in an attempt to impress an exclusive underground hacker group. It's not true, though. I mean, you all saw. The virus didn't cause the crash. He served six years in prison and emerged a changed person. He reached out to me last year about helping with HAP, and we're happy to have him. The victims. Dark Twilight Tiff. Citizen 0556332. It's Mavis. Rod's anti-government page. Vernon Rubber 50. That was Carl. Ringleader Roddy. And Zane. Hmm. All died. It's scary stuff, isn't it? Isn't it, Mushi? Well, let's start working on this lost and found. Lost and found one. The Chowder Man song. He wants the text file for it. Adrian wanted to know if you could dig up a song that Chowderman wrote about his helicopter accident. That's right. He remembers only a vague lyric about losing a leg. Adrian swears he sent him a text file with the lyrics and chords and would really love to have it again, as I believe it would soothe Adrian's soul. Artie. Well, we could do that. We've got to go to this era, and we will search Chowderman's page. For the Chatterman eyes only, do not look. If you do not belong here, then do the right thing and go. I hope you all like the final Chatterman song. I missed bid you adieu. Downloading Chatterman one elegedman. Downloading one elegedman. Sad stuff, huh, Mushi? Or capture December 31st, 1999. Wow, so the rumors are true. Eric and I didn't have compatible auras, but I can't deny his talent and sheer lyrical brilliance. I am sure One Legged Man would have been a hit. Not sir, I'm not sure One-Legged Man is the kind of song you put out to make a hit. It seems more like a vent song there, Artie. Look at the next one. Lost Early Song Demo. Recordings of a now famous rapper. Kev J, a close friend of mine and famous rap star, Remembers putting his early hypnospace. Uh, remembers putting his music on hypnospace when he was in his early 20s, but never really getting any attention. All he remembers is that some guy deleted him from a listing 
saying that his music wasn't real music because it was flip-flop, and that he should do something more imaginative instead. I asked if he maybe used any search tags, but he didn't even know what I meant, but this may be hard to find. Finding this would be a huge deal. Well, we'll have to go... This should be a good date, and we'll search lip la. Yeah, didn't expect them to have a plist page. Downloading Red Strike Push. Red Strike Remember May. Maybe Connie backed it up. Gearhead Greg is a helpful and well-meaning individual, but I would strongly advise against using his password security tips. <laughs> yep. Received from half underscore Tamara. I love it. Downloading Kev J underscore We Are Dance Red. Downloading Kev J underscore Buffet High Stress. Important message received from MS underscore Samantha. Whoa! Sam! I'm sorry, Mushi, I was distracted by the good music. The very good music. Give me some pets here. Yeah. Yeah, get you some pets. At the risk of sounding like I'm fame obsessed, I have to say that I that this find is going to be enormous for us, and the hap Kev J is the hottest flip flopper today, and his fans and patrons are going to eat this up. His recordings are so adorable too, especially the buffet one. Ah. Private. My name is Samantha, but you know me as Chelsea. Here, wait a few seconds, I'll show you. See? Switching back over to the Samantha account. Important message received from MS underscore Samantha. Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. I have something very important to tell you. Please wait for me. In the meantime, do more archiving or something. I have a lot to say. Once upon a time, I was an overworked employee at Merchantsoft. You can still see my picture up on the team page. While we scrambled to put together HypnoS, your 2000 update, Dylan Merchant worked on whatever he pleased. Blist, some weird big game project. I also caught him hanging around some hacker group a few hours before we went live with the update. A giant software package was uploaded from somewhere else in the building, while everyone else was gearing up for Merchant Soft's New Year's Eve party. 
I believe this was a software patch added to the year 2000 update by Dylan, inserting last minute changes that ultimately caused the Y2K mine crash. I believe Dylan Merchant is responsible for the resulting deaths. I believe Dylan, w I believe Dylan knowingly allowed Tim, a fellow team member, you know him as Tim again, be framed for this disaster and spend six years of his young life in prison. I need your help to prove it. Details incoming. I need you to find access to files that prove Merchant Soft knew the year 2000 update wasn't ready, or Hypnospace knew that their technology could have harmful effects on its users. I do remember Dylan having an anxiety attack over a security breach right before Y2K, so maybe look underground. Attach this email as an installer that will add a Submit to SAM button to your HSPD enforcement toolbar. Using the SAM hammer will send whatever you select directly to me without alerting the rest of the HAP team. If you find this information, do you have any do you know uh, do you have any idea what will happen? You can see justice done, all without telling a single soul. Are you ready, partner? Let's do this. Downloading Sam Hammer. Ooh, it's it's go time now. Important message received from Hap underscore Artie. Oh, what's up, Artie? An auspicious edition. I cannot overstate how proud I am to introduce my good friend and former full-time employer, Apple Roll, please. Dylan Merchant. Oh no. I'm sure you'll find him as valuable as his as a valuable source of information and intriguing conversation as I have over the past two decades. So Dylan is part of the HAP team. Important message received from Dylan. Haha, <laughs> thanks for the warm welcome, Artie. If any of you come across something that seems like it came from inside Merchantsoft, Documents, images, work in progress, fragments. Please contact me before going to the rest of the group. I can verify stuff, provide context. I'm an open book with a lot to offer here. Excited to join the passionate team and make sure the full legacy of Hypnospace is preserved properly. Sent for my D phone. No, no, Dylan, I don't think I'll be sending you anything. Except to jail! Oh! You've got hypno mail. Re re policy for adding team members. Hello Tamara, I'm excited that we have another new member like everyone else, but I realize I already did this somewhat independently. Can we just bring folks into the core team anytime we want going forward? You don't have to worry about my authority, authority being leapfrogged. Artie cleared it with me before bringing Dylan on board. Actually, my sp my speaking to Dylan about Hot Kelp joining and our new potential to access the Merchantsoft intranet seemed to play a major part in his coming abroad. That said, if there's any issue at all with anything, say a new recruit, please let me know. Direct messages, smoke signals, anyone is free to talk to me through whatever they're comfortable with at any time. It's my job to ensure that everyone here is safe and comfortable, not just funded. Happy face. Oh no, nothing like that. Just checking how things are supposed to work for people like that internally and going forward. Happy face, but it's got a cute nose. You can... You can tell she's joking around, because happy face with a cute nose. No ulterior motive there. Fine. Perfectly fine. Oh, 
Ooh, what do we have here? Downloading Hypnopur Prositive. Prositive. Not Prosita, Prositive. Free Hypnocure! What this means now is we can check nets on their pages. That'll come in handy. Okay, so if we want... If we want to find info, we have to start looking for hacker groups. The only hacker group I recall is Minx. Remember my, my trauma with Counselor Ronnie? Minx seems to be a group, not a person like I thought. One of the people in Minx was The Reckoning, but spelled all leet-like. So let's search that. You should have a Hypnospace page. HS Toolkit now in Freelands. Wiki pipe, piping only searchable. We know what to do with this. Hmm. That HS Dream Tools theme thing seems important. Go pay attention, Yimushi, don't worry. Well, if I were a secret hacker tool hidden in an RPG page, I would use this. <laughs> I was right, sort of. Let's reload this in safe mode. Downloading HypnoS underscore Dream Tools. Let's see what we got here. Oh, it's a wares cracker. These tools are built on Merchant Soft's internal debug tools. Some functions identical to their original design. Some I've had a little fun with. You get infinite health. Infinite happiness. Max speed. Go, Mushi, go. Poo interval. Zero poo. Oh no, that's having the reverse effect that I wanted. Oh no! Changes everything. The Final Reckoning, Act 1. 
Merchant Sop commissions Hypnospace headband clinical study to silence beef brain rumors. Let's try it. Uh, beef brain was fake. Act 2. Merchant Soft isn't happy with the findings and buries them, instead commissioning, taid, uh, commissioning paid tests by independent experts. Act 3. Reckoning releases copies of the damning documents, bringing an end to Hypnospace and Merchant Soft. Uh, sorry, buddy, that didn't happen. Good riddance. Click here to download unreleased Hypnospace clinical study, ab abstract and sleep study sample, share far and wide. Ticket. Important message received from MS underscore Samantha. Oh, oh, oh. Dear God, Hot Calc, you just found the jackpot. These reports have horrifying implications. It seems that people in sleep time really weren't sleeping that much at all. Surprised more people weren't hurt. You find anything else? Inbox exchanges, chat logs, really anything where Merchant Soft admits any fault, send it to me. There has to be something floating around out there. In the meantime, I'm going to start putting this information together for the authorities. Samantha. Getting serious. Important message received from Dylan. Uh oh. Ha ha. Reliving your enforcement days. Hey there, Hot Calc. I noticed you're racking up violations on some user. You do know that there are other ways to get Hypnocorn, right? Anyway, just thought it was amusing. It's funny that our violation reporting system still works without the servers online. But hey, it just goes to show you how good I am at coding. Blah face. Also, your name sounds so familiar. Did we use chit chat? Uh oh! What do we got here? Donate to Hacks Gods. Donate to the Hacks Gods. Positive values only. <laughs> I'm gonna do it! Do not steal from the Hex Gods! You will be punished! Oops! Merchant Soft's Leaky Piping Leaky Piping 1 Mystery of the Deleted Zones Leaky Piping 2, Dylan's Bad Car Game. Ooh. Is this enough, Sam? I think we need more than that.
happy four. This sounds bad. So you have promises to be a very, very interesting for Merchant Soft. Sounds bad. We should probably stop using Hypnospace now. I'm not a medical expert, but if I'm reading it right, they're basically telling us that people aren't getting decent sleep using Hypnospace. Lazy bums who stay up watching TV don't get good sleep, so what's your point? In Hypnospace, they could talk to people who learn which helps brains a lot. Not my point. Doc said that. Look, don't worry about it. If people are tired after sleep time, just get on fewer nights per week. People are responsible for their own choices. Too much ice cream will kill you, but no one does studies on that. Yeah, I have to space it like ice cream. It's good. Adrian, you are an absolute idiot. It's fine. Also, our study is privately commissioned by us, so it can just stay private. Ooh. Good. Report said that beef brain is fake, right? That would be bad for PR. Real brains did that. Yuck. Not good for the evening news. And Sam, I'm guessing you're still trying to get Outlaw in for the 2000 update. I don't mind this HSPD stuff, but it wasn't the job I was hired to do, you know? As a matter of fact, we're uploading a press preview demo now. As long as the team puts in hours, it'll be there by 2000 for sure. Surprised? Yeah, but I'm skeptical. Yeah, but more skeptical than surprised, Dylan. I'm begging you, please, please, pause the game right now and get more people on stability. I just ran the update last week and it gave me the worst headache of my life, literally. This could seriously hurt people. Ooh. I think we got him. Message received from MS underscore Samantha. You are beautiful. No, I'm hot. Just drop dead gorgeous hunk of investigating prowess. Did you know that? These conversations are painful to relive. Thank the stars we never followed through on banning Tim. Together with those clinical trials you found, we have enough info to put away Dylan Merchant for a long time. Stay tuned. Who knows? You might hear my name on the news. Oh, your name, not not your name. Kramer. So what do I do now? Important message received from Dylan. Oh. Hello, Samantha. Pretty soon you'll figure out, like I did. That Hap Chelsea is actually Merchant Soft Samantha, former employee of Merchant Soft. Working with Hot Calc, she's attempting to compile evidence that proves that Merchant Soft is guilty of several crimes, one of which is knowledge of inherent dangers associated with sleep time computing. Whether she found and submitted these files or not, the truth of these allegations is simple. I am responsible for the Y2K mind crash. Attached, you'll find a link to the confession of sorts. Sorry if this letter sounds a bit formal. I've been waiting to write one like it for a while. Dreading it, actually. However, I'm not scared anymore. It's been eating at me for over 20 years, and I just need peace. I'm not expecting forgiveness from any of you. I know several incredible people that I previously did not. I finally experienced hypnospace and the beauty its citizens brought into the world for myself. I am so, so sorry to you, Tim, more than almost anyone. Send this to whoever you need to or want to. Here we go.
Ring leader Roddy has ascended. File retrieved. Huh? I still hate Gooper, by the way. Dark Tiff has ascended. Power uh, received from Dark Twilight Tiff. Zane Rocks has ascended. File retrieved from Zane Rocks. Burn Rubber 50 has ascended. File retrieved from Citizen Burn Rubber 50. Mavis. I think that was Mavis. I, I don't remember ID names. There's Rod. New outlaw has been chosen. Dylan. Track me down, take me, and I won't put up a fight. Downloading seven files. What a fantastic game. I don't know about you guys, but I had a great time. Roddy, you not buy you might not buy this, but I considered you my best friend at the end here. My work consumed me and became me. People who weren't helping me build my masterpiece were invisible. Through all of it, you were always willing to come back and put up with my garbage, and God I wish you hadn't. I'm sorry. Zane. Could have been someone your mother was proud of. I'm sorry, Zane. Mavis, I'm sorry. Tiffany, I took your future away from you. Your little worlds delighted others. Mine destroyed them. I'm sorry. 
Rodney, your family came after us hard after the crash. They disgusted me. They smelled like body odor. Their clothes were stained, stretched out, and dirty. They were flip-flops. They came all the way to San Francisco to our offices, and we sent them away. I want you to know if they're still around. I'm going to make it right. I'm sorry. I hope you're with your wife now, Carl. Sorry. Oh boy! Every single person in this game did such a great job. Uh, Hot Dad's music as Chowder Man. Fantastic. Jay's music. Fantastic. This song you're hearing right now. Fantastic. Every single person. I'd like to thank every single person that recommended this game to me. I am so happy that I finally played it. Um, since this is my anniversary, you know, doing a big, huge thing, I'd just like to thank everyone in particular for just a, a whole year of VTubing and video games and silly Q&A videos, and I felt like the game to celebrate the kind of nostalgia appreciation I want to foster is this game here. Once again, thanks everybody for watching, playing, commenting. Uh, just thank you so much, guys. This has been Hot Kelk playing Hypnospace Outlaw. And I will see you later.